Hello dear wonderful friends, welcome na naman tayo dito sa ating munting kusina. Welcome here at La Arnie's Kitchen and Food Creations. Please come join with me as I'm going to show uh, with you our very simple lunch for today. So let's get started. So this is my cooking pot or my wok and my old uh, favorite ladle or uh, wooden wooden mixer i should say <laughs> okay there you go so i preheated my stove or my cooking pot i'm going to add approximately six tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil not necessarily that you are going to use extra virgin olive oil whatever sauteing ingredient you have in your pantry whatever you're used to in sauteing simply you can always go ahead now friends for a savoring enhancers i'll be using hoisin sauce now hoisin sauce it's a type of vegetarian sauce and then if you don't have like this no need to worry you some people will use oyster sauce but i don't use oyster sauce at all so i rather use this hoisin sauce or you can use toyo or any kind of uh, um brand you can use or soya sauce toyo <laughs> and then i'll be adding black pepper and a combination of beef powder broth okay there you go what are the very basic ingredients that we have i have here my spices lots and lots i use 10 cloves of garlic uh, ginger strips of ginger one large tomato one large uh, white cooking onion white bulb you can use whatever uh, you can use red onions or even the sibuyas dahon or the green onions i use one large green pepper bell and so these are very very sweet that i can even eat raw <laughs> okay so i have here one pound or half a kilo of beef so i slice it into uh, thin and also i have here one large of uh, um, upo or long squash and i have here the stem so i make sure i wash it thoroughly so stem of the gailan gailan is the ch uh, chinese type of um, chinese cabbage or broccoli or whatever <laughs> okay you can use pecha if you have so i make sure that i wash this thoroughly so because the leaves are large so i try to uh, slice it into halves okay let's get started so what i'm going to do is i'm going to to saute the ginger and the onions uh ginger the onion uh the garlic and the white onions all together wonderfully into my wok so friends, we will just saute this until this will become slightly golden brown or uh, translucent. It doesn't really take that long in the process of sauteing. Maybe 40 seconds before I'm going to add my kamatis or tomatoes. One of the many secrets that your um, dish will be flavorful is lots and lots of uh, lamas or spices but if you're on tight budget you can always adjust um, the amount of your spices or lamas after which i'm going to add my uh, tomatoes or kamatis okay there you go i'll be adding black pepper lots and lots of black pepper i love black pepper when i'm going you can use white pepper friends okay there you go then i am going to add my uh, hoisin sauce adding your serving enhancer it depends upon your taste buds and also this beef powder broth a combination and also i'm going to add my beef you can use chicken whatever meat preference you want uh, to use simply you can always go ahead okay friends then i am going to cover that no need to add water but it's up to you if you're going to add water or liquid 
So I'm going to takip it or taklob and set it aside until the beef or the meat is soft and tender. Okay, friends, let's try to check. So I'm just going to give this for another uh, three minutes. Okay, I'm going to cover this back so it produces lots of juice. Set this aside. Okay, friends, it's about time that we're going to add our uh, stem of the gailan, the leaves, and the, these green peppers, and also this upo all together because the hardness or the thickness, um, they will cook at the same time. So we are going to hollow or mix it. Now, I don't really need to add water because the upo will produce its own um, water or juice. <laughs> because the upo, it's succulent type of vegetables. But it's up to you, friends. If you want to add water, the choice is always yours. So, I'll cook that for, let's say, two minutes. I'll cover it and set that aside, friends okay there you go wonderful friends for our final touches or finishing touches we are going to mix this thoroughly so i don't want to overly cook the veggies i want it a little bit crunchy so finally the last but not the least these are the greens or the gailan So we are going to mix this slowly, slowly but surely. Once again, wonderful friends. Thank you very much for watching La Arne's Kitchen and Food Creations. Till the next time, so this is our beef with veggies. Whatever veggies you have, zucchini, broccoli, cauliflower, the choice is always yours. So I'll have to turn off the flame. Voila! Till the next time, happy cooking wherever you are. This is your home cook buddy La Arni saying you daghan ka ing salamat friends and then sa sunod na pud nga higayon dali mga una ta. So by the way, my rice is ready, my fluffy rice. Okay. Thank you very much for supporting La Arni's kitchen and food creations. Bye for now friends.